explosions, shootings, helicopter crashes. Sounds like an action movie. In reality, it was all part of an emergency exercise involving U.S. and Mexican agencies. The goal? Be prepared to keep our communities safe. ABC 7's Josie Ortegon has that story. Well, you want to go up the bridge? Secure the area. Okay. We're going to be blocking routes from I-10 to Boda. Local law enforcement agencies say they hope they never have to respond to these calls. They have to be ready, though. That's why they hold a binational drill every year. Each drill is different. They're chosen based on national trends. It was a, a shooting incident at, at right at the international border on the Rio Grande. This year's scenario takes agencies to the Bridge of the Americas, where they respond to a large explosion. Several injuries are reported, vehicles are on fire, traffic is in a gridlock, and people are running for their lives. Agents and officers with 17 Mexican agencies and more than a dozen U.S. agencies participated in the drill. They were separated into groups. Relayed to them via telephone and then they have to act uh, through their communication methods and deploy personnel in a simulated fashion as if it was really occurring in real time. Each agency responds differently. We need to know uh, what uh, resources we we have for for attend this type of emergency. Hospitals, uh, vehicles. Juarez Fire Captain Gabriel Rodriguez says manpower is never a concern. In the real world, it can be difficult to coordinate the most efficient response with so many entities involved. That's why communication makes all the difference. Many of the times it happens this something fails. The communication fails. It's one of the most important things, the communications. Joe Sirtagon, ABC7.